Welcome to Insider Medicine In Depth. I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Though performing a craniotomy to relieve pressure in the skull following a traumatic injury may initially appear to be beneficial for patients, it may also compromise long term outcomes, according to research published in the New England Journal of Medicine. Here is some information on craniotomy. It is a surgical procedure in which a portion of the skull is removed. It is sometimes performed following a brain injury to release pressure inside the skull that builds up as a result of swelling in the brain. The benefits versus risks of craniotomy for this purpose remain unclear. Researchers from Alfred Hospital randomly assigned over 150 adults who had elevated pressure inside their skulls as a result of traumatic brain injury to receive a craniotomy plus standard care or standard care alone. Before entering into the study, efforts were made to reduce the pressure by non-surgical means and these had failed. Those who received the craniotomy initially seemed to fare better. They required fewer other treatments aimed at reducing pressure inside the skull, spent less time with extremely high pressure levels and required less time in the intensive care unit. Six months later, however, those who received standard care alone were less likely to have ongoing evidence of brain damage. Both groups of patients had similar survival rates. Today's research suggests that a craniotomy should be considered a last resort for relieving pressure caused by traumatic brain injury, as it may reduce the chances of having a full recovery. For Insider Medicine In Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.